No, I'm not going to keep going because I was down by three minutes anyways from failing the, the end of Lurkers. I'll do one last run just for, for run's sake, man. After that, yeah, I'm done. That sucks. <laughs> That's why you have to be really careful around jetboarding uh, Crimson Guards. They can do that to you. That happened to Boomer. When Boomer was uh, running this category for the first time, that happened to him like a few times. He was like, what? <laughs> Kept on shooting by accident after getting hurt. Unfortunately, the side flip button is the same button as shooting. Yeah, so there can be a buffer. It's okay. Also, what up, Rub, my boy? I wanted to make like a gunless, uh, ex like video, Rub. Explaining like the history of it and like the tricks found. So I don't know if you want to help with that. I'm calling it no guns now. Nah, it's gunless. Some people are just confused on what the like gunless means, I guess. But I need to ask you and Rao and whoever else worked on gunless on like how it was even found in the first place. Oh, I found like, uh, coming back, oh my god, the wrong car. Coming back, I found a, a three minute time saving core. Uh, and a 20 second time save coming up. It's called Waterfall Skip. Pretty cool. And then I found a strat in Defense Stadium where I'm just gonna use the Dark Bomb and then collect Dark, uh, collect Ego on the way to construction site from enemies. Did I say 20 minute? Uh, three minute time saving core. Not 20 minutes. Twenty second, that's what I meant. Waterfall time save. Oh shit. Oh I didn't load the area. Fuck. What didn't I load? I don't know how I didn't load that. We're going back. We're gonna lose a little bit of time. Fine. Fuck, 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 fuck. Hit the ceiling. We're good. Twenty minute. Alright, we made it in there. We're not losing a whole lot. It's better than dying, failing this. Yeah, I'll show you. It's a cool. Tr it's a cool strat. Since uh, you don't have to go all the way around the whole temple area, because we don't really need um that extra power cell in the fucking heads. Dude, can you hit him? Fuck you, aimbot ass. Got it. Oh, I missed this part. Hold on. Alright, there we go. Cool strat, though. Dude, seriously. Oh my god, this is the most cuck thing ever. Yeah, it's such a Jack 1 strat, like honestly. It's something that would be found in Jack 1 for sure. Okay, 
Now last guy. Let me die. Nice gold. Pretty sure I got all the tricks first try, so that's good. And I got the roll jump strat too. God, that was big lag. I'm gonna punch next time. Roll jumping in an airlock is not good for emulator. Yeah, I really like that strat though. Haven's fun to do. It's quick. And... Shit. Yeah, I'm on MU. Don't own a PS2 at the moment. Or PS3. <laughs> but MU works well enough. Yeah, you see the line. I think Vazer said there's a way to fix that. The only... There's only uh, about three issues with emulator. With this uh, dev kit. Um, you'll get slowdowns in airlocks sometimes if you're too fast. Like just one second slowdown. You'll get slowdown sometimes um, once in a ghost town. And a slowdown in defense when you're entering the defense stadium cutscene. That's about all. Deadbot has a really good config for Emu. Yeah. I have most of it. The blue the, the line in the sky thing I haven't fixed. I should probably fix that. And if there are any fixes for the slowdowns, then this would basically be perfect. There would be nothing wrong with Emu at all. It's lagless. Alright, I'll look into that. I've tested so many emulators, and this is the best one for like when I'm playing 720 also, because I'm also playing on HD uh, settings. It. Okay. Blind and sky thing is weird, yeah. I don't know why that's a thing. <laughs> Get a PlayStation. The best thing to do if you want to play this game like realist is realistically get a PlayStation 2. There's a line in the sky somewhere. I don't think it's here right now, but... In a certain time of day, it's called the horizon. Yeah, it is natural. What do you mean? It's no tech glitch. You look up right now, you'll see a line in the sky. It's called the big ass line. It's called the Aurora Borealis. Aurora Borealis. Here, at this time, in my kitchen. Oh, fuck. Stop. Okay. Zoomer was cucking me from moving. Oh, there's a line. <laughs> we'll just call it Aurora Borealis from now on. It's so beautiful. Somehow gold, whatever. Just gotta keep gold in this game so I know my what my sum of best is. Cause right now it feels sub 120 feels almost possible, but my golds aren't good also. Gone. Yeah, it's a good early game, I'd say. 
Minor. There was a minor fuck up, but Haven went really good. I'm gonna lose that time back real quick though because of uh. Because of Praxis RNG that I have in this run. I had a one minute Praxis. <laughs> Deo! I really hope Deo gets uh, world record soon, man. He had a PB the other day that was insane that he had to retime, but it wasn't it, unfortunately. He's got to swoop them all, all the, all the world records. Also, I can't imagine, I can't imagine honestly running Spyro with that rat shit at the end. At the end of the run. Horrible. And it looks, it looks so fucky too. Yeah, you can get, you can get good runs like almost every time. And then the rat <laughs> just happens. The moon doesn't bop him, I'll be- yeah. That would be great. Yeah, part of me doesn't want anybody to bop him for like... Before he gets uh, any percent record. I want him to get- I want him to get both. To have both at once. It's for like, a time. Where to go? All right. I don't know if y'all know, but uh, during AGDQ, the last AGDQ. Uh, Deo was... we roomed together. We roomed with the Jack boys. And, and with Ru too. Ru was there. So it was cool meeting him too. Please! Kill them all. Okay, good. You ready for Praxis? Are you ready? For the best fucking thing you've ever seen in your life. Oh, that was sick. Right, let's line this up. Alright. Aggroed me, kind of. Alright, ten minutes later. Y'all can go to sleep right now. Wake up in a few minutes. Yeah, hopefully this won't be as bad as last time, man. It's looking bad, though. He hasn't hit a single one. That's so sad. Okay, there's one after I said that. He is destroying all the poles, though. Alright, casually. No problem. Hopefully when you get back, you'll be done. On, RNG bots. I almost want to reset this up. But I'm probably gonna be- I'm probably gonna die if I do that. I'll give him three more chances. Okay. Nice. To bait. The 
the fastest bots you've seen is in your demonstration video. I'll check that out. I've gotten bomb bots in 30 seconds. He's gotten like a. He, I've had him get a triple kill, um, and then back to back right afterwards. And oh my god, holy shit! I'm gonna reset this up. I'll just do it. <laughs> you like that lava tube skip trick? <laughs> this should be better, hopefully. Oh, stop debating. I know the boys are kind of cute though. V1. I just did a fire cannon skip V1. This angle usually is better, so hopefully this works. Oh my fucking god, stop. Police! I wanna be- I wanna just do one last run and it won't even let me out of here. Okay. Get a triple kill right here. Ooh, back to back. That's not bad. I've tried grabbing at, at that very end. It doesn't work. He'll miss all of his shots. Oh, back to back to back. Last one. Can we get four in a row? No, of course not. This last one's going to take probably the longest. If I'm being real. He's going over. The last one is the hardest. <laughs> this would suck at a marathon run. I do want to run this category, like, at a GDQ or something one day, or at some event. It'd be fun to do. It's gonna rage super hard and fail. Oh yeah, wham! That'd be sick. Now would be a good time for donations. Until they don't even have any donations left. Holy shit. Also, it up split. Come on. <laughs> Come on. I reset it up again. Oh, he sprayed his butt like 20 times there. How did that not kill him? This last dude just does not want to die. That's not good. Ow. <laughs> Magnificent! What an incredible feeling! Oh. Oh shit. Morphine. For the, with the two gifted subs, bro got it too. That's sick. And John Wall, they're both they're both usually in here. Magnificent! What an incredible feeling! Yeah, that threw me off too for a second. I was like, wait, what happened? Yeah, thanks, Morphine. I appreciate. It. Oh, I'm done. Thank you. We're losing hella time though. That's some major sex, my dude. I'm sure when Bra comes back, because he's probably just chilling, he'll be pretty stoked to see that. Be like, what happened? Alright. I do have an emote on the way too that I'm making. I have another emote slot available for tier 1. No, I missed! It's pretty cute. At least I got that. Pajama <laughs> sand pencil. Yeah, that's my next emote. Um, oh my god. Look at my time. I lost. Where? Did... He didn't shoot. Hello? My time. Oh my god. I just. Oh, that killed him. Okay, cool. That was a YOLO. YOLO bomb. Let's just get out of here, man. I just wanted to show you all the run, but I don't know if I can PB really. I I can PB. I can definitely PB. That'll be time saved for next run. Nasty. Sniped. Oh fuck. Yeah, I just gotta not die next time in Lurkers. Or Defense Stadium, and I'll, I'll get it. Yeah. 
We'll be back in the future for show. Okay, cool. Yeah, that was a good chunk of it. The scariest parts are at the end, though. So if you do want to watch that and have a heart attack, uh, like a group heart attack, you can do that. It's pretty fun, dude, just to have a casual bro heart attack. Yeah, my ultimate goal, uh, I'll be working on this constantly, trying to get sub-120. They all can see my road to sub-120. See if I do get it. Weird slow down there. Love me some auto attacks with the boys. Oh shit. Nice dropped input. You gotta find a way to. Th I'm using a, a DS3, I think. I really do want a PS2 controller. Hook up to the computer. Be nice. DS3s are kind of weird to get used to. They're not that smooth. And I don't like the R2, the R2 buttons. No, there's no input delay at all. Now there's analog sticks for sure. But the analog sticks feel weird. They like kind of, I mean, these are kind of worn in, so it's starting to feel like PS2. I play a Jack one on MU, there is so much delay. You, yeah, you just have to find the right settings for it. I like can't believe that it works like this. If you play, if you ran MU or used MU anywhere like more than a year ago, it's going to be utter shit. There's a lot of updates to it of DS4 also. Oh yeah, that's something to that. Yeah, if I if I had any amount of delay, I wouldn't be playing right now. Trust me, I would only be playing if it feels exactly like PS3 slash PS2. Especially with a category where inputs matter so much. Don't hit him. Thank you yes. for that. Dude, these guys are spawning in the worst spots. Gonna collect eco. Yeah, it's really nice. They're doing some work on this. I don't like that they're so low on health though. I just gotta be very careful. Oh shit. Thanks for that, man. I'm just trying to get past you guys. I hate them too, dude. They're worse. Uh great. Wait, he's still alive? What the fuck? Apparently hitting him didn't hurt him. I don't know. Oh, nice. Guess that works. Oh god, this guy's really far away. Okay. Thank god I didn't fail the mission. Gotta be careful here. I'm trying to collect a lot of dark eco because um, I'm trying to like use it at the end of the mission, in case I get sussed. I bet that would be fast if I could implement it here. 
I just don't know if you can save up enough for a defense stadium. I need to be able to save up enough for that. I canceled the putting the gun away input. The animation. Don't hit him. It's going well. We almost have enough. Hmm, must get the ammo boxes. <laughs> oh yeah, it can go horribly wrong. It's just kind of RNG times. The run can get scary. Like, even bomb bots, that can happen. Bomb bots can get super scary. Um, they can start shooting you at the last bomb bot, and they'll be like, level 4 chasing you, shooting you, and it's so hard to actually beat the mission without dying. Just have to make sure nothing goes wrong. Hey, what up, scum? How's it going, man? Finally caught a stream. Seems like everybody's been missing my streams. Like, people are, uh... Seeing me from, like, YouTube or something, and then they'll just never be able to catch my stream. So that's cool. I'm trying to change my sleep schedule a bit, too. Uh, my stream schedule. And sleep schedule. Yeah, I heard about that. That's insane. Texas, too. Texas got screwed. I don't even know what I'd do without power here. We'd probably just freeze to death and die. So hopefully all do are doing alright. UK viewers be like, fuck. I When I streamed late at night, um, I did get a lot of UK viewers. But I'd have to stream at like 1am. Ow. Okay, that's the one thing that can go wrong. That is bad. I'm not doing that on purpose. Jack is just like, moving forward. Oh my god. I'm an idiot. Why do I keep doing that? Alright, well, I hope I don't fail the mission. Yeah, I'm West Coast. I just have to not die here. Jesus Christ. It's surrounding me. I'll be very careful because they start shooting me on the last bomb bot. So this is gonna be freaking scary. And also there's so many... at me. Please, get me out. I'm getting in this car, I don't give a shit. Get me out of here. If they kill me even now, I still fail the mission, so I have to get out of here. Yeah, and they start shooting me, see? Oh, that's a big nope. Get me out. We're at one health. Take my username, damn. I'm just casually clutching. 
Aren't you usually in a machine or something here? Nah, I don't. That's in a different mission earlier. And uh, you can like, or maybe that's Jack Three. I know you can take control of a bomb bot somewhere. Yeah, that is Jack Three. Good, we made it through alive somehow. I didn't expect that. But yeah, I was just talking about how bomb bots can go badly, like... And it almost happened. I kinda jinxed myself. Well, hopefully that made lur my lurkers turn out well. Because bomb bots went so horribly, lurkers is gonna be amazing. This is my last run though, so hopefully I just make it through. Missed it. Oh no, I missed it twice. That's not good. Oh shit. Casually, casually failing the race, not doing lap skips. Yeah, you can go whenever, but this will be the last one, so it's either a PB or not. There could be a chance. I have Defense Stadium locked down a bit. Damn it. Damn it. So I'm hoping to not fail that. That's where I usually fail. Uh, I'm just gonna do this. It's the dude's gonna uh, bash into me. I do the other skip. Okay. And yeah, we should be chilling in these next few missions. Up until, uh, Lurkers. A god run of this would be amazing, though, one day. It would be incredibly frustrating and might even take, like, years, but... I could see, like... Somebody hitting like a 117 with current current route. That's just have to be resetting to Praxis so much <laughs> to get that 30 second uh, uh, round two. That would be horrible. There are some runners who do that though. They'll reset over and over and over and over and over to this one. RNG moment. Where it's like plus 10 or minus an hour. Your choice. I don't think I can run those. Get out of here. I bet what I could do is like put my gun away. Actually, I don't think that would do anything. I think I'd still shoot. I was gonna say I could put my gun away. I have Peacemaker out kind of in my backpack. So if I were to hit a guard, I wouldn't automatically pull out and shoot. But I don't think it would do anything. I think I would pull out the yellow gun by default. I'm down to like 10 seconds I reset, even if I have minutes to save. That's what I'm not trying to do. 
Especially with a gun list. Like, I'm behind a minute and 40. But I could save, like, 10 minutes later on. With this, from this one trick. That's just super hard to do. So. I try to think in the long, grand scheme of things. Or the best, actually the best way to think is, like, look at your best possible time. Like, you're some of the best, right? And then look at your best possible time. And whatever time you can get, if it's still a PB, you should keep going. Even if you can't PB yet, still, like, if you played, like, really well. Like, it was a one second PB to best possible time. You still play for practice sake. Reset list missions are... Will really help you with, like, getting good at games, too. Talking about the ledge grab you found like a week ago. Uh, no, nah, I found a. Uh, I found a couple strats. One was uh, I'm gonna use defend. I'm gonna use a uh, dark bomb in defense stadium, and then heading to construction site. I'm gonna collect eco, since the city is so overloaded with enemies, anyways. Collect Eco, spend 30 seconds there, and make sure I get through Defense Stadium. First try. Otherwise, um, if I fail Defense Stadium, then I lose like 10 minutes. Yeah, and late game practice is important too. I used to late game practice any percent a lot because that's where I was most weakest, right? Because I'd reset heavily in the first half so much where I wouldn't even see the second half for like weeks and you don't want that you want to once you reach the second half you want to be good at it too so there's ways to like strategize and plan out uh getting better at something versus like you know not improving at all That's where I like, I kind of implement my chest head, my chest forehead. I took a chest test yesterday, like an ELO rating, rating thing quiz, and uh, I'm a lot higher rated than I thought. <laughs> I played chess seriously for like a few years, um, when I was like 19, when I stopped speedrunning basically. I played for a few years, and uh, recently picked it back up. I've been playing often. Oh god, that was very laggy. Yeah, my, I took seven, a 76 question um, test with chess. And my rating's at a 1850. That's pretty sick. So I always think like, I think in like strategy terms. Oh nice, fucking sick dude. Barely hit that guy. An 850? Nice. I started out horrible at chess, but like... It just reminds me of games like Sudoku. You can learn to strategize and get better at it. Oh yeah, I, I still... I don't have a chess club anymore. I used to join my college's chess club. And even kids there would shit on me. I'm a lot better than that than during that time because I was only rated like a twelve hundred. So but once you learn enough tactics and you practice like lots of puzzles, like if you're practicing the right things, then you're gonna get better. But if you're practicing the wrong things, you're not gonna go anywhere. Hopefully that got it. We're good. Like, there's plenty of people that will play chess, like, pretty seriously for years, and then they'll only go up, like, 100 points. 
during that time. Like, there's some people that I know that are pretty old. They've been playing chess, like, all their life. And <laughs> they're still, like, uh, like, 1100 rating. But some people just learn- also, some people just learn differently, too. Nobody- not everybody learns fast. Some things are just difficult for other people. Feels punch. Come on, dude. I've been messing this up all day. Thank you. Okay, third try is fine. I'll take third try. Brain perfect is annoying though. Don't hit the ceiling. Third try is fine. Well, apparently that is not solid, so that's good. Dude, I almost have Dark Bomb, actually. These guys don't drop Dark Bomb, unfortunately, though. Or, they, they don't drop Eco, so I can't use it. Otherwise, I should probably be a good idea to use it. Should probably implement it here somewhere. <laughs> the ammo is necessary. I do that by muscle memory. I'm, I'm dumb. Okay, thank god. You gotta kill those guys instantly, and then you won't. Otherwise you'll lose time, because they'll fly back, fly away from you. And if I can keep getting that ap uh, to happen, uh, I won't lose any time at all. Gold by a huge margin. Are you killing your own dudes? Fuck. If I go after them now, they're just gonna get zapped by the other guards, which is risky. I don't want Samus to die also. But I wish there was a really good way of manipulating them. That is kind of worth it, I guess. I don't know. I didn't want to j fall off the edge. If I fell off the edge there, I'd probably lose the run. Samus will get zapped. Oh, well, he still got zapped. I'm dumbass. No! Okay. Oh, he shot his own guard- his own guy! That was hilarious. He shot his own dude. That helped a lot. Oh, there you are. I'm back up. Don't kill him. Please. They should come down here, naturally. I don't know why that is, why they come down here, when you're down here, but they do for some reason. Alright, one left. Yeah, if you didn't have to wait every time here, you could probably save like a good minute, but uh, I don't really know how to manipulate them. Kill them. While killing the other dudes. Fuck. Good. <laughs> now I have Dark Jack. That went by fast because he shot the other dude and I didn't have to worry about the second uh the second dude. Slowly making my way back. I could probably be even and buy lurkers. I have to try really hard. If we get a a godly perfect lurkers, that can be probably even. Yeah, that was a good gold. I just wish... That's probably the next thing that I hope is found. Some way to manipulate... God, why slag? Some way to manipulate, uh... So that you don't have to do that. 
like where you can kill all the flying dudes while you're uh, killing the people on, on foot. Would be nice to set that up. And where is Dark Jack useful? Probably nowhere. I don't want to use. Oh, actually. Okay, I'm thinking. If this were to happen, if I had one health in Lurkers and I had to kill the last flying dude, maybe it's a good idea to use Dark Jack. Because then I won't get. Uh, if that were to happen, though. They would start shooting me, but if I got into a car soon enough, after I killed the last uh, car, it would save me from dying, at least. Or having a big chance of dying. We'll see, though. And I can always collect... Um, I can always collect eco... Like before Defense Stadium, because there's still enemies everywhere. I didn't load for a second. I almost bricked that up. I was just like barely off angle, but we're good. Oh, the jetpack flying thing? Um, you mean the hover glitch with uh, the jet board? Yeah, it's... Yeah, I am good at it. Like I, um, it's, it's built into my muscle memory now, but when you start out doing it, it's pretty tricky to do consistently. It's a bunch of inputs at once that you have to get exactly. But once you know, once you can do it, uh, once you can do the glitch, and you keep practicing, 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 then you can do it every time. Like it's something you can learn to do 100% of the time. It's just, um, you're supposed to jump, hold the, the left stick halfway to the left, press L1, at the same time, and then move the- oh god, the life. And then move the other stick, uh, or move the L stick straight up or down. And then, uh, start mashing, uh, L1, I think? I don't know why I said jetpack flying. So I've tried to describe it to you, but I can't even describe it in words. There's a bunch of tutorials online, though, if you look up Hover Glitch, Jack. So you can uh, look at the inputs. If you're good at Tekken and you're good at comboing, it's just it's just like a combo, combo move. The tricky part of it is doing it under pressure, though. I'd say, because there's a lot of moments where you're. You miss it, it's over. Like, that's it. You miss it once and you're screwed. And that's a good com that That actually happens for Gunless, too. If I miss the hover um, going into core, then I fall and die and I lose invulnerability, which means my run is over. There's a lot of pressure for that. I usually uh, don't worry about it. I'm confident enough to not miss it. The one thing I do have to worry about is lightning, though, because since I'm in core, lightning can happen, which lags the game, which can cause you to drop your hover. So that is scary. Uh, bad cycle. Off. 
Very scary, man. Taking it slow. <laughs> I do not want to die here. I'll lose two minutes or a minute or something if I die here. Then we won't be able to reset warp out of uh, into lurkers. A little, a little bit of time loss is better than uh. It lags all versions. It'll be laggy. It'll be pretty lag laggy on PS2. Damn laggy. Okay, let's uh, let's just not speak like anything into existence. Let's just try to do this the best we can. This is where it gets hard, though. I'm just going to stay quiet here so I can focus on getting all these one frames and not dying. Goodbye. Uh, okay. that to happen. That should have been safe, but it wasn't. Nothing I can do about it. Okay, I can do this without getting hit. Missed. Okay. What? Where the fuck he went? Over here. Alright, just have to not get hit at least once by these next two. Shit. Did not see that tree. Should be, yeah. Okay, they're not after me anymore. If I get off, if I get on my jet board, they usually stop chasing me. Fine. Just gotta kill him here. Good. Thank you. Okay, we should be safe. We have two health now, instead of one. Crossing the bridge, though. I don't want to have to, like, crash into anything. That guy's there. Come back for him. He's going to be in the safe zone. 
where the lurker won't fall in the water. Or at least should be. Nice friendly fire. <laughs> Just very. This section's very nerve wracking. Why is that dude? Did you see that dude? I'm gonna be safe about this too. Cause he, I've had him fall in the water there too. Okay, and we're solid. We're losing a bit of time, but um, we made it through alive. That's what matters. I just wanted to get through this section. God run? Perhaps. I'm, a, I'm still a bit behind, but we can, uh, we can save time here now. I didn't go for the one frames on perfect, uh, on purpose because I didn't want the lurkers to fall in the water and ruin the run. But yeah, we should, we should make it through. That part's pretty hard. It's hard to get those, uh, those tricks. Okay, nice gold. I can still gold that by like a bit, but it's pretty. It's gonna take a like a lot of runs to do that. But now we got late game. This is where it gets intense. By the way, late game is super intense. You fail the mission if one of the lurkers falls in the water. And in that last section, you're surrounded by water, so you gotta be careful to not blow them up into the water. It's very scary. Easy skip? Uh, yeah, for me. Things can still go wrong in it, like, with this skip. You gotta be kinda careful. You can blow yourself up on the wall. That should be good. And I've got multiple, um, multiple of these boosts, so. Perfect. I just have to practice it. Oh god, that guy was right in front of me. Um. to pause buffer perfectly there because um, when the dark jack icon is up it doesn't let you get into a vehicle and there's also a text icon a text log that's up too and that doesn't let you get into a car so I had to pause for both of those in order to get into the car it's really annoying like especially when you're getting shot and stuff it's annoying They're just blowing up around me. And that little uh, zoomer jump s skips into this new section. Oh, that was scary. You, haven't, you guys don't even know why that was scary. Like, it looked like I just got hit by a guard, but I was doing a side flip. And it almost took my uh, R1 input, which means I almost used my gun. Like it almost buffered my gun. You side flip into somebody and then get hurt, 
sometimes Jack will shoot. Even when you're not pressing anything afterwards. It is automatic rip run. So I had to like pause there for a second to make sure I didn't do anything. Plus 23. Oh, we had time save there. Okay. That's actually sick. We can be even by uh, before underport. That's where we have a lot of time save. We can do it. We're 121. We're 122 pace basically. That's super good. Thank you. Okay, I made it in. <gasps> we got first try. Let's go. Huge. That was a frame perfect trick that I got first try. That's nice. Oh, I hit the ceiling. That's okay. Gotta go up here. Sometimes there's like. It's like something, an invisible wall. Yeah, that's really good. Saved a lot. Whoops. Come on. I'm really fucking this up though. I know, it's such an easy gold. Okay, we didn't die. Good. You can hit a death plane there too. So you gotta hover high enough to flip over, but not high enough to, uh... I don't know if that gold's legit- if that's legit. I might just restart that. Come on. And I love this section, this section is funny. It makes through so fast. Where is he? Quick <laughs> crew skip, that's funny. can't roll. If we roll and bonk into something, it's over. So now the goal is to keep, if we want to get 120, the goal is to keep invulnerability all the way up until core, until the final boss. So we just can't fail a mission and we can't die. We gotta keep this all the way through. This last fucker. If we didn't get crew skip, that would have been a f that would have been a 120 pace or a sub 120 pace by a lot.
Okay. Good. Made it through. We lost a bit though. We lost 25 seconds because of the me messing up the hovers and stuff, but good enough. Now I just need to make it through. We can save so much on our port. Then we gotta keep our invuln in defense stadium, and then we're good. Well, and then we gotta finish the game. And hope we don't fall off the edge in core. Got this reports. Okay, good. Now I just gotta make it through. So did not want to die there. Fall and die. I'm not even gonna roll jump anywhere. You watching me? Huh? Oh, is something here? I thought you like ordered food or something. Oh. Need me? Okay, thank God. Okay, we made it through life. That last part's scary where you're almost about to get eaten. You have to do that extended front flip on the jet board. Okay, now the moment you've all been waiting for, Defense Stadium. We gotta make it through first try. Oh, I missed it. The... 
Alright. Can't crash the game either. I'm gonna switch my cars because you're more likely to crash, uh, it seems like, in the Crimson card. Just being careful. Every time I've crashed, it's been in a Crimson car. As of late. Oh, really? People say it's the other way around? Okay, no jinxing. Please. like practice. I'm just doing it now. One of them's pretty low. over. He died. Fuck, man. <sighs> he got hit so many times, dude. Can he even make it anymore? I don't know, man. That's over. This is my one shot, and I got so unlucky with the last... With one of the Samoses, he was so low for no reason. Because I have invulnerability... But the only thing I can do is reset, because they can't do anything. There's a way to, like, punch the car. He won't make it on its own. Fucking over. <sighs> that was my one shot. It's because I... It's because I did it too soon. I used the Dark Bomb way too soon. I should have waited until all of them spawned in. I was getting nervous that they would die. Well, that's normal for me anyways. I always lose my runs here. It's the worst, it's the worst area. By far. Now I don't even have Dark Jack. I'm gonna have to do this. That's such bullshit, because now look at them, dude. Now they're fine. They didn't get damaged this time. Makes no sense. They just didn't... They just 
get unlucky. I didn't even use Dark Jack, and I managed to get all of them. Just, just out of pure luck. Oh, now they're gonna die now. Because he spawned right next to them. Dude, I can't fucking hit these guys at once. Like, they're in front and behind at the same time. I can't hit both of them at once. It's actually impossible. No. Thank you, game. Uh, you can use Dark Bomb here, but this is not a PB, I don't think. So hard, dude. This category is so brutal in this area. Like, I can't get both of them at once, they both got hit. right now. He already died, are you kidding me? They're so weak, I know. He is not supposed to die that soon. I'm gonna load my save. So unlucky, man. <laughs> It's the worst possible mission to do. All RNG, all luck, some, some manipulation. Like, it's pretty impressive that they're not spawning in the front right now. It's like the best place to do it. But even that didn't kill all of them. This one should be safe. I know, right? If only I just used a gun. Now what I'm doing is I'm collecting eco. Um, for this next area. Alright, now, since I don't have invulnerability glitch and I couldn't keep it long enough, I have to do an insanely hard trick. It's a one... It's a one frame trick, but uh, it's much harder than just that. You'll see. I have to pause on the same frame, I blow up my car. Much harder than you think. Shit. I did not see that guy. Right now I'm farming eco. Called Deathmatch. One more. Yeah. Or one frame trick. Well, I wouldn't have to do it if I survived in Stadium, but... It was kind of my fault that I used the Dark Bomb so early, which caused too many of them to be around them. We'll work on that. 
that method helps a lot. Like, a lot, a lot. It makes it easier, but it doesn't make it free. Oh, that's kind of annoying. It's because I was totally sub one pace. Ow. Not sub one pace, sub uh, 20 pace. I lost five minutes. Get this first try. I think I got it actually. Come on. I got it. I got the frame perfect trick first try. No way. So lucky. I might be able to PB then. That's insane. That trick is so hard, you have no idea. I've done that for like 10 minutes straight and missed it every time. Oh shit. Didn't splat though. I'm supposed to splat. Missed the splat. There we go. Oh, I'm almost dead though. What did that skip? Uh, I'm invulnerable now. So I need, basically, um, in order to defeat Core, you need to have an invulnerability glitch. There's only two ways to do it. Mega. One way is to pause on the same frame. You blow up your car. And the other way is to uh, get off your jet board on the same frame you land in lava or a death plane. One health though, that's weird. <laughs> Might be able to PB. They lose five minutes though. Sucks. Wait, what's here? Not eco. Wow, the lightning happened right as I hovered. If I drop my hover there, you lose the run. That was weird. Okay. Am I going away? A lot of eco there. That was really good. So what I'm doing now is I'm collecting eco for last phase because it will save me a lot of time. I can use dark bomb for last phase. Giving me only a little bit of eco though. Kind of annoying. That's why farming is really helpful. Ammo? Oh, I'm good. <laughs> Don't need ammo. Even though I'm collecting it. I'm not gonna use it. Okay. So now we gotta do this trick. This trick is hard to do and I gotta not die. Fuck. Man, this is it's not doing it. This trick's pretty hard. I gotta just. He's going really fast though for some reason. Oh, I missed him. Okay, you're supposed to uppercut him from underneath to stop him from moving. Like that. Okay, got it.
And that's how you get him to stay still, so you can just punch him like this to death, instead of collecting eco. Oh. Nope. Fuck. Can't make it. I can't let him move. Come on. Oh, we gotta keep going. Gotta do it again. Oh. Ah, I missed it. Okay. Fine. We're good. Got it again. It's hard to- it's- that's a hard trick. It's very scary too, because you don't want to fall in the pit. I'm like, right on the edge of the pit. Yeah, it's a very scary way to die too. But it's super fast. Compared to collecting Dark Bomb Eco. Yeah, I've definitely uppercut into the pit before. Like, I tried to do it. You have to do an extended uppercut. And then you have to make sure you survive it by not falling. So you have to hit him from underneath to get him to stop moving. And then you uh, get him to stop moving on the back end of this side. Because there's enough room to hit him. Yeah, now you see why it's helpful. It would be impossible to beat this with, uh, without invulnerability, but I got that first try, which is super sick. Unfortunately, I died in Defense Stadium, though. Really sucks. Okay, I'm gonna wait for him to punch me. Alright, because he's invulnerable here if he punches. Now we punched him to death. Now you know why I collected Eco for last phase. Because <laughs> this takes forever. Saved about like a few minutes. It's, it looks scary because I'm on one health, but it doesn't really do anything. Like if I were to splat, I would die. Yeah, it's a, it, the third phase got faster. I found new strats, sort of. Like, you can uppercut him and punch him in the face while he's moving away from you to get that extra damage. Because he's invulnerable a lot of the time when you're attacking him. But these are helping. If only we could get him, like, stuck in a wall or something and just keep attacking him, that'd make this quicker. Ooh, okay, we got it. Okay, it's pizza? Oh, you should answer it, because they're just going to stand in front the whole time. Long in a sweat shop. Make my pop. This is a Jack 2 rap, by the way. Anybody who's wondering. 